the deeper understanding of your existence begins with the initiation of spiritual awakening. It is the first step towards finding the divine essence within, a highly personal and miraculously transformative journey. It means to have a glimpse within and see your mind and heart as they truly are. Far away from the influences of the world, this is the journey where your third eye, the eye of divine consciousness, opens and you begin to question all that you have been fed with throughout your life, your beliefs, your psychology, your perceptions, and even the very sense of comprehension. On this journey, your heart deepens, your mind expands and broadens. It is the place where you discover all your hidden potential and you become altered in each and every approach of yours. To truly reach the depths of your existence, you must break away from the norms of the world you are living in. You have to get rid of the past memories, expectations, and everything that the environment has given you. This is no easy task, for you have been practicing these patterns for too long, many since childhood. But this is the point. You must have the courage and make the necessary sacrifices to become unbound and liberated from these shackles. Once you have taken this step, you embark on an unstoppable journey towards success and accomplishment. A journey that will take you closer to your desires. But as you look deeper within, you will automatically forget what is outside. For your inner world is always bigger than what you see on the surface. From within, you have always aspired to be someone who is more than these outer boundaries, who wanted to have more from the divine, the one who wanted to break away from the prison of the outer surroundings. You begin to feel empty, losing interest in the company of materialistic people. You want to become self-sufficient, to be in a situation that is grand and of an everlasting nature not the ones you are living in right now. You begin losing interest in day-to-day -day usual activities, and instead, you want to attain spiritual things. You want divinity. You want the whole universe to be on your side. You want to experience the richness of the world, to discover the undiscovered, to see the unseen. All these desires make you discontent and keep you at war with the usual boundaries of the same day today activities. As you begin your journey of spiritual awakening and break away from the usual norms, the next step is to have a clear direction towards the divine. In this attempt, you begin to question your existence, your career, your happiness, and find contradictions with the world's ways of living. Material gains and money no longer give you happiness, and these quests for happiness give you a sense of direction where you could find the ultimate source of happiness within your own self. You explore your inner depth and commence your journey of spiritual growth. This discontentment is a call to action, a nudge to make a move toward spirituality. This journey is highly profound, 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 and transformative. You begin finding peace and positivity, love and passion, instead of the materialistic approach. You find solace in tranquility, and you don't like disruption. You become kind and sympathetic, and all your concerns, worries, and doubts vanish. You develop a sense of confidence and trust in a higher power, the divinity. This is where your potential unfolds, and you begin to acquire your spiritual rising. Your enlightenment begins, and your true transformation starts. Everything has to start from a new beginning, as you no longer have past set standards. This will create discontent at first, but you must have patience and trust in the higher power. With patience and trust, you will reach the true level of your existence. It is only through patience and trust in the higher power that you will get over the storm of discontent within. As your trust level increases, you will reach closer to your destination, your true nature. And this 
is where you will find real peace and blissfulness that is everlasting in nature. This state is called the abyss, where you leave your ego behind and come to know that you are divine in nature, one with the universe, cosmic in energy. In this state of being, you will find love in each and everything, a love that extends to all forms of existence, a love that is beyond any personal biases or concerns. You will find harmony with each and everything, and this love will give your life meaning and direction. You will begin finding synchronicities, coincidences that will eventually take you towards your divine destiny. You will automatically appear at the right place at the right time, and all things will begin happening your way, guiding you towards your divine purpose. You will no longer be afraid of the challenges put in front of you by the universe, for you will develop a belief that the entire universe is by your side. These challenges and trials are actually there to take you closer to your destiny, to make you reach your place at the right time. They act as catalysts that boost your way toward your divine purpose. You will begin to realize that the material gains and objectives you once had, due to the influence of the outer surroundings, have no significant value. They are meaningless, as they do not play any role in your blessings, blissfulness, or sadness. You become truly authentic, no longer wanting to become what the world wants you to be. You don't desire to be like someone else or to get rich like somebody. You just want to attain what is rightfully yours, for you find that you are the one who owns the whole universe. It all belongs to you. You no longer need outer world approval for having or doing anything. You just have to be authentic to yourself and to the whole cosmos, which will ultimately unlock all your potential and break you free from the outer judgment you will act as unbiased, deciding each and everything on merit, giving an authentic expression to the universe and the whole world. When you do this, it means you have become ideal and unparalleled, existing in your originality, with the whole universe genuinely becoming your priority. You no longer want a fake identity. You have reached a level where you accept and acknowledge everything based on their intrinsic divine nature, rejecting the outside illusion that only leads towards darkness. Accepting your inner self and rejecting the outside makes you a true friend with yourself. You no longer require any outer world stimulus or source that could make you happy, feel good, confident, or give you a sense of identity. You have become self-sufficient, skipping the need to look at yourself through the eyes of the outer world. You Accept each and every flaw of yours as your strength, for what was once seen as a flaw in the eyes of the outer world is now ignored, allowing you to truly accept who you are, your values, and your authentic self. At this stage, you see the world with your own eyes and make it as per your own values, glittering it with your own light. You then encounter another shift in your reality, as your consciousness elevates and expands beyond the normal, usual boundaries of day-to-day -day life. You understand your universal unity more deeply, and you begin experiencing higher levels of consciousness, seeing the hidden synchronicities and coincidences and coincidences in all your actions, reactions, and the happenings in the universe. You become egoless, and your bond with the divine grows stronger, reaching a level where you completely identify with each and everything around you, ignoring all the fake societal identities given to these things. It is as if you have mounted a high mountain, and now you are looking down, your vision broadened, your heart and mind expanded and deepened. You are now looking at everything from a height of clarity, from the height of baselessness, being completely neutral and divine in nature, you begin realizing that you have to accept both the height and depth, the beauty and ugliness, the perfection and imperfection, the day and night, the small and the big, 
the tiny and the huge. In fact, you acknowledge the divinity in each and everything, accepting it as it is. This way, you are able to see life in its pure form and existence. The next step after this level is achieved is the development of a divine responsibility, where you are determined to bring all these things in their genuine divine condition and reality far away from the world's perception. You become an active co-creator with the universe, no longer passive and dormant towards the divinity of things. You uncover the hidden realities of the things and help to make the whole universe a complete unity where everything goes with harmony with every other thing, heading towards the journey of manifestation of all your dreams, wishes, and desires. You become a part of the big plan of the universe, knowing that all your co-creation is playing a significant role in the overall working of the universe. You find that creativity is intrinsic in nature, and you all have the hidden power of this creativity. You just need to have a deep understanding of your nature and the courage and power to accept it as your own. In this higher level of existence, you realize that creativity is your own living expression, your reality. You are a part of the divine creation, and you have been bestowed with the power to influence the whole universe just by bringing into use your thoughts, intentions, perceptions, and feelings. You become aware that the universe is also completely aware of all your actions and positively responds to all your positive actions. In the final chapter of this transformative journey, once you reach and unlock this massively powerful level of your existence, you begin being grateful for each and everything, whether it directly connects with you or not. You become conscious of the processes in the universe, becoming a divine entity of the overall existence of this whole cosmos. Your creativity becomes imperative for its growth and evolution, and you develop an unconditional love for each and everything, breaking all the constraints and boundaries set by the world. You completely see what the universe is really up to and how you play your part in making it more advanced and evolved. This realization not only contributes to the development, evolution, and growth of the universe, but also makes your existence higher as you weave every step of the universe's evolution and make your life a living example of the divine home filled with love, gratitude, passion, sympathy, compassion, and belief in the higher power. I urge you to go through this information, to practically act on it in your life, and to share your positive experiences so that you can be an inspiration for others on this transformative journey of self, discovery, and spiritual awakening.